Without question, we are faced with the greatest threat to our lives in recent history. For the British Asian community, the coronavirus may be even more serious. Research suggests that more than a third of patients who are critically ill in hospital with the virus are from ethnic minority backgrounds. We will look back at this moment and wonder what did we do to help. Today, we can all save lives. Please, please continue to follow the government's guidelines. Please adhere to social distancing. Only leaving the house if you're a key worker, for essential food, for medical items, or daily exercise, and of course, keeping two meters apart. I, like many of you, have elderly parents, in-laws, relatives, neighbors, all of whom are highly vulnerable to the COVID-19 virus. It's important that we protect the elderly and the vulnerable, especially those that have underlying conditions such as diabetes, heart disease, lung disease, and any other illness that makes it harder for them to fight an infection. And it's also important that we don't have any physical contact. Make sure that the elderly and vulnerable are kept in separate rooms and if possible have their own bathroom. Ensure that bathroom and common surface areas are wiped clean after each use. If a separate room isn't possible, create a separate area for those that need it and make sure fresh air circulates around the room. Please remember to say no to visitors and no to meet an extended family and friends. That cha-cha that annoys you a little bit, but you've got the perfect excuse not to see you now. Doing so will save lives, and what could be better than that? Making sure we wash our hands, make sure the whole family, kids. Please ensure everyone has regular exercise and a healthy diet with plenty of fruits and vegetables. This helps protect you. It's time to say goodbye to too much fatty and fried foods, sweets and desserts, and to cooking with too much ghee. We have all been on incredible journeys and have so much to show for it. Surely we will survive this too. It's time for us to act responsibly. It's up to us. God will answer our prayers if we've been sensible and vigilant. We have to do the right thing in order to survive this. So please take care of yourselves and those around you.